The Shelly Co Marathon is a race for fuel efficiency. It is not about going faster. It's about going farther with your fuel. It is a competition where we invite top schools, uh, engineering schools, to compete with other engineering schools in Asia to build uh, their own cars and then to race it or to bring it to the Sepang International Circuit and then to go farther with the least amount of fuel. Last year, we had three schools that competed, Mapua, Don Bosco, and UST. We had a very good performance because all three teams uh, that went uh, that participated from the Philippines were able to run, they passed all the inspections, and they were able to log very good times. In fact, uh, our teams uh, performed the top, top quartile of the entire 100 teams that participated last year. This year, we have six schools with seven participating teams. The three schools are still with us, and they are joined by three other schools. This is De La Salle, TIP, and University of the Philippines in Diliman. Mapua has two teams uh, participating. And we expect as well even better performance from all of the teams uh, that are participating because I, I think we have a very good uh, start from last year, good experience, and we have good backing from sponsors and, uh, and the school officials that are helping us with this competition. UP is building a hybrid car. It is a deep diesel engine coupled to an electric uh, generator and motor. La Salle is actually creating a plug-in electric vehicle. It's purely electric, much like the electric jeeps or electric tricycles that you see, only that they're using modern materials, modern engines, and modern technology to innovate and to create solutions for our mobility challenges. But technology innovation has always been in, in our schools, and I think the Filipino students, the Filipino and universities are very good. It's just that we need to give them more opportunities as this, to turn their ideas into actual practice.